is really sweet. I like that little jewel you made. I do. Okay. Well, we've got a Father Frank O'Reilly with us. Now, he's been wowing his churchgoers and any audience member at all in all the lounges and nightclubs he's been performing in. He likes to sing a lot. And actually, Tamlin and I, Miss Lolo, we met him at a bowling alley. We were doing a gig for the Friday Night Fish Marigold. Fry. Marigold. Yeah, Marigold. Mm -hmm. And we were having it for um, just anything we could do. And we did, were having it for the fish fry. And we met him. We thought, what a voice. Let's bring him on. We're going to chat a little bit. He's going to do a number for us. And then it'll be really nice. He's playing opening act, too. Mm -hmm. uh, that's really nice. Okay. Now, you've been dubbed. The, the Father Frank Sinatra McCally, McNally, McRiley, McRiley, sorry, because of your velvet voiced stylings. Yes. That's really good. That must be quite a compliment for you. Oh, it is. Now, oh. you, were you a friend of the, was it Chairman of the Board? Is that what they call? That's what they, yeah, old blue eyes. And, and, you were, and you were quite influenced by him and you look up to him and you like to emulate him? I do. I do. I, I, I think. He st sets an example for all singers out there, you know? Yeah, yeah. he's quite the stylist, don't you think? Quite, quite the stylist. Quite the stylist. Everybody from uh, Steve Lawrence mm -hmm. to uh, Jack Jones. Mm. Love Boat Singer. Yeah. They, they, all, they all look up to him. And I feel like uh, Harry Connick Jr., there's another one. Mm. We all yeah. look up to him as sort of, you know, the, uh, the pinnacle. Sort of like how... Uh, an opera singer would look up to um, uh, Pavarotti. Lucky Pavarotti. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Pavarotti or a Maria Callas. Well, there you go. That's how we look. Okay. Up to him. Do you emulate his lifestyle too? No. Ooh, oh good. no! No! Ooh. No! Oh no, oh no! What influences did you have now as a youngster, learning about God and things? What influences persuaded you that hey, I want to teach God's word. I want to sing. Help me well, out here. Well, they, they sort of came together. Uh -huh. sort of, uh, there was singing and performing, and then there was the priesthood, and it all sort of came together. When I was young, I was so influenced by the, by the, uh, the movie uh, The Singing Nun with Debbie Reynolds. Ooh, I, do you one remember of my that? favorites. Do you remember one that? One of my favorites. I remember that. And, um, and, the, and The Flying Nun, and one of my favorite stories that we, we tell almost every every uh, year around the holidays uh, is how when I was four, I really wanted the soundtrack mm -hmm. to the, the Flying Nun with Sally Field, mm -hmm. and my parents couldn't find it, and they got me the, they got me the Singing Nun instead. Mm -hmm. And it, it, in a way, it changed my life. It uh -huh. was really uh, uh, a moment. Well, I, 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 I'm sorry, Miss Lola. No, my favorite is uh, Dare Bingo and Going My Way oh. when he portrayed the progressive father Chuck O'Malley. You know, I try to. Uh, we we just screened that at the at the parish mm -hmm. the other day. Mm -hmm. oh, I wanted to thank you guys for showing up at at the bowling alley. Well, we do we what made, we can, you know, to we help. We made ninety eight dollars that night. We would well, have made uh, fifty more, but we had well, to pay that sound. Well, man. you should yeah. take some but. of those prayer shawls back for the retired priests and oh. nuns. <laughs> okay, that, that's a good idea for them. Now, what do you think of Sister Act? Now they've had a sequel, I believe, mm -hmm. and I was just wondering what you think of Sister Act. Did you it showed the church in maybe a a hipper light, kind of more of a, um, I don't know, a, a thing to do. Well, we went to see it as a field trip. Okay, and, okay. Uh, and our, our, some of the older sisters were offended by mm -hmm. the violence in it Ooh. and and, but they, the, the, and the yeah. bad language. Mm -hmm. We were a little bit, they were a little bit put off by that. Mm -hmm. And it sort, of, it sort of tainted it for mm -hmm. them. I my okay. personal favorite is Mary Wicks. I think she makes a marvelous sister. She she She's did. been in the trouble with angels mm -hmm. and where angels go, trouble mm -hmm. follows. Mm -hmm. And they always throw her in mud or water with her gym shoes. And yeah, it always yeah. seems to. Now, with I a hear smile on her face. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you're going to do us a number right now, aren't I'd you? I'd like to. I'd like Ooh. to do well, I, I did this. I did this the night at the bowling alley, Ooh. and I yeah. remember you. We, we want you to repeat it if you could. And Marty, we're set up for him, aren't we? It's I think a lovely, we're all set. A lovely Burt Bacharach, Hal David. Ooh. Okie doke. Well, you can go right over there, and you okay. just give us a song right over there. Uh, we want to thank him. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. I'll try. It'll no. be fine. that 
time can't disguise the look of love is saying so much more than just words could ever say and what my heart has learned why it takes my breath away i can hardly wait to hold you feel my arms around you how long i have waited waited just to love you now that i have found you you've got the look of love it's on your face a look that time can't erase be mine to not the start of so many nights like this let's take a lover's vow and then seal it with a kiss i can hardly wait to hold you feel my arms around you how long i have waited waited just to love you now that i have found you don't ever go don't ever go i love you so don't Thanks very much. Nice. I hope to see you sometime at one of my masses. Oh, sure. Thank you. Thank you.